NCAA tournament against South Dakota State tomorrow night at 635 in Omaha. Jack Leto is with the team in Nebraska and has a preview. The Iowa State Cyclones are coming into Omaha as one of the hottest teams in the country, winning a Big 12 title and playing the most impressive stretch of basketball we've seen from the Cyclones all year long. But that title, those big wins, they mean diddly squat when you get to the NCAA tournament. I mean, we just got to move on uh, from the last tournament because um, I mean, we got the national championship in our eyes and flush what happened last weekend, focus on this game, one game at a time. Uh, we get right back to the next thing and, and our guys have done a great job of that all season, whatever it's been, and we know that they'll do a great job of that here as we approach this opportunity. In that Big 12 tournament, Iowa State had to run through three games in three days. Their opponent, South Dakota State, did the same thing in the Summit League just a few days earlier. So the Jackrabbits have a rest advantage. There's going to be a lot going on uh, going on uh, during this tournament and uh, in our days. So I think the best thing right now is just taking breaks when we need to and uh, coming back with full energy. Practices, they haven't been as hard as I would say they were like, you know, in December and November and stuff like that, but we're still going at it pretty hard when we do go. Uh, but just getting on to the next thing, you know, that's what TJ preaches day in and day out. You know, you just go day by day, take it day by day, so I think we'll be prepared for it tomorrow. Iowa State tips off with South Dakota State at 635 on Thursday, and as you'd expect, there are a lot of connections between ISU and TJ Otzelberger's old team, the Jackrabbits. I'll have more on that coming up at 10. Reporting from the CHI Health Center in Omaha, Jack Lito, KCRG TV9 Sports. Thanks.